Hey guys, Glockenstein Monster here, and welcome to the gaming experience of Mega Man X5 for the Sony PlayStation. And this video game playthrough is brought to you by GameAnyone.com, the number one source for video game authors. So, yeah, I'm on Mega Man X5 now. I've done 1 through 4. Um, I know there's a PlayStation version of 3. But that, no. The title of that one should really be Mega Man X3, skip ahead to Mega Man X4, because nothing happens. Um... Just to let you guys know, um, um, I will get 100%, um, on this game, we'll play this under normal difficulty, and of course I'm going to be cheating my ass off. Uh, one of the codes, um, I'm only going to be using for one stage, and that's Squid Adler's stage. But that one, all I have to do is get to the fucking end. And I'll still get the reward therein. Um, this, one, this one really is just a spur of the moment kind of thing. Playing this on the PSP. Go under options here, get rid of that. Cannot stand dash on the circle, never have. Mm, yeah, we'll do that. And everything looks good here. Okay. So we're going to st uh, start a new game. Um, now here it really uh, does mean uh, you get one thing depending on who you start. Here you get the use of his uh, buster. With this one you get uh, the uh, fourth armor. So we'll be playing this with uh, starting this off with Mega Man. At least giving him a set of armor. This was intended to be the last game of the franchise. And move on to Zero. Yeah, that happened. Not. I'm at least letting you read all this, so... Don't think too negative of, of me. Yeah, as you can see, they just don't hide it at all. They're just saying, uh, spoiler, Sigma's, <laughs> Sigma's caused this. They're not even bothering trying to hide the fact. But overall, this is one of my uh, personal favorites. I thought it was good. It wasn't great, but it was good. So, how am I going to do this? Well, I'm really thinking about uh, uh, doing it one way. And that would be having it, um, um, I'm really leaning towards one video per, uh, a level per video.
But yeah, one of the things that's been holding me back on this one is the next game. And the fact that little bitch Alia... Oh, shut up. Other than the fact that Alia will interrupt gameplay and not let you go until she's had her her say. But it's the next game. This is going to be a slow merger for me, just to let you guys know. Oh, I'm still continuing. I'm just throwing on the code right now as we speak. Uh, walk on spikes. I've always found that to be bullshit. So, yeah. Just putting on the codes now. More will be uh, added as uh, the game progresses. That'll do. That'll do. Okay. Oh, shut up, Alia. Piss off. And what's this? I ducked. What the hell is going on here? Nice little feature they added. I may be using infinite life, but the crusher can still kill me. However, crushing can also be a friend. Boom. Yeah, when you jump, make sure you hold up on these and you'll grab it just like so. But anyway, we are almost to Sigma's bitch ass. I know, short game, right? Long. Know how to wall climb, bitch. Nice statue there. Unfortunately, it's got a dirty secret. Zero, you're right. Yeah, he's okay. Just a bit of a bruised ego. He'll be fine. He packs sandwiches. Alright. Pick up any readings. He's a virus. No shit. I believe that was established in X2. One of my personal favorites, but enough of that. Yeah, get going. close by, uh, yeah, remember that dirty little secret I said about the statue? Well, Zero's not exactly wrong. 
What the hell? Hello, Sigma! Yeah, that was a dirty little secret. Just duck here and you'll be fine. Those will home in on you. And they'll try and lunge. He is not hard at all. Come on, Siggy, you can do better than this. Seems to be his only weak spot is his mouth. Big enough, I know. Believe it or not, had I be playing legit, I'd be perfectly fine right there. And there's Sigma. You know damn well that's not the end of the game, so... Same as we can out. Looks like it's uh, covered the entire planet. say he lost to us on purpose, like an ass. Ugh. What's the matter, having troubles getting a hold of me, bitch? You had no troubles earlier. Hello, Siggy. Yeah, well, I think we do need to get out of here. X, get over yourself. The people in Reploids, what, are they too fucking stupid to be able to do shit on their own? We better stop that. Here's the Enigma Cannon. Well, the Enigma. It's a goddamn cannon for crying out loud. Oh boy. Well, let's just not hope. Well, let's hope it doesn't come to that. <laughs> okay, so the whole gimmick with this is we got um, 16 hours to collect parts for the cannon. Or we say fuck it and go straight to last resort, the shuttle. So, of course, we're going to go for the cannon option first. And with any luck, uh, we'll stop this shit. I will be showing off the other stages regardless, so... The Enigma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I know it would normally be only 16 hours, but uh, like I said, I'm cheating. Infinite hours, baby! Okay. So with this game save, I'm going to call this a video right here. Yeah. So, uh, when we continue in the next part, uh, we will be moving on to start up the actual Maverick stages. So, yeah. Um, just to let you guys know, though, uh, I'm only going to be using the PSP to play this game up to up past the uh, Squid Adler stage. Off the clock, I'll be coming back to this game. Only uh, we'll be using the X Collection. So yeah, like I said, that's going to be done off the clock. I don't think you want to hear a rage going on, even though that's going to be a distinct possibility. So, like I said, once you, so with that, I'm going to call this video right here. I want to thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more Mega Man X5 for the Sony PlayStation. I'll see you guys later. Bye.